Please be good, please be good, please be good. Not bad. Yeah, I like that. Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. My name's Paige. And I'm Nat. And today we're gonna do a wine tasting from an advent calendar that we picked up at Target. <laughs> what? You kind of have to add that nowadays. People go I know. crazy. Yeah, we will. We'll have to put a disclaimer or something. So here's what the outside of the box looks like. The advent calendar is from a company called Jingle and Mingle, and they also have a website where you can look up the box that you purchased, click on the day for the wine that you want to look at, and then you can read more about it if you like. Like I said, I got mine at Target, and it cost $69.99. Here's the inside of the box. It has the numbers 1 through 24, and you can kind of pop open each section and grab the wine within. So we will get started. Why doesn't it have 24? Because Christmas doesn't count. Okay, we have a glass for red. And then we have a glass for white, so we're not mixing. They're not even metal or glass, they're plastic. Well, number one, Antler Envy. It is a Cabernet Sauvignon. Smells like wine. First one. Oh, it's not as bad as I thought it would be. Oh, yeah. I mean, oh. Okay. Ranking out of 10? Six. Maybe like five yeah. for me. This is a Riesling. Oh, it's a Riesling. That aftertaste is weird. Yeah. I don't know. It wasn't bad. Not bad. Like a six. Yeah, I was going to go six or seven. This one is called Precious Lights. I don't know what a Bordeaux is. I think it's a red. Oh my. I don't think I'm gonna like that. <laughs> the aftertaste. Yeah. That's it like... was fine until the aftertaste. Yeah. Oh. Do I have to finish this? Uh huh. <laughs> Negative three. Oh. So one. One. Okay. Probably a four. Oh, this is Snow Crystals. It's a red blend. It's kind of cinnamony. Little oaky. Five. Yeah, I'd go five. This next one is called Winter Wonder and it is a Chardonnay from Italy. Yeah. 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 It's not bad. What is that one name? I'm, I'm giving it a seven, but I don't like it. I thought the next one, number six, is called Who's Been Nice. Just kind of watery. Mm -mm. Three. I'll probably give it a seven like I would drink it and not hate my life type of thing. All right, this next one's called Sparkling Ornament. I think it's six. I'd probably give it eight. It probably doesn't deserve an eight, but I know that as far as wines go, that's mm. not a bad tasting wine. Right. Okay. This is Festive Fun, and it is from Portuguese, which I'm going to assume is Portugal. Um, it it's says in... Protégé. <laughs> I'm nervous. These reds make me so nervous. Please be good. Please be good. Please be good. Oh. Seven. Two. Oh. I hate red wine. This one is called Pink and Gold and it is a rosé. We're sweating so bad. Not bad. Yeah, I like that. Not bad, Nate. I was thinking 8 too. Yeah. That's probably my favorite so far. This one is called Will Wrap for Wine. I like this. The design. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I like the label. She it's likes cute. the design. The label is cute. Yeah. I'll give it a 7. I didn't mind that. Probably a 4. Really? I don't really like that. Oh. Okay. The next one is called You Always Bring Wine. 
I'm feeling it. Like Mr. Krabs. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Nope. Four. No. Three. Three. Five? <laughs> is that a question? Five. Okay. okay, now we are getting somewhere. We This is number 12. We're getting a little merrier this year, and that's what this wine is called. I love a good Pinot. I did not. That sounded oh. naughty. Jeez! <laughs> no, I think I just got too excited and I forgot what we were doing. <laughs> That's a pino. I like a pino. Give it a nine. I was gonna give it a nine too. Yeah. Right, this is called Tinsel Time and it is a sweet red. That's not a very sweet red. The smell makes me wanna throw up. I know. I can't do the smell. Like the taste is fine. Hold your nose. Yeah, that's bad. It's bad. Oh, Jesus. <sighs> yeah, that was nasty. Oh, God. I okay. couldn't even fit it. I, I gave it a it. seven. Probably give it like a one, the lowest I can. Do you need me to finish it for you? Yeah. This one is called Snow Fort. Six. It started out really good and I liked it and then the aftertaste. Seven. It was nice and light. Mm -hmm. It wasn't like really kind of gross like the other ones. You're like that? Okay, remember when you would play the dragon game and you would feed the dragon the cheese? It's like, help us find the dragon game where you had to feed it the cheese and it would make that sound. Okay. So this one's called Holiday Vacation. Oh, that's gross. Two. Two. Four. Mm. This one is called Vino Decor. Six. Right, eight. You're right. This next one is called Party Sweater. Party it's a red Sweater! Blend. Oh my god, that's so gross. Funny. Wow. That is drier than the Sahara. Bulgaria! Fix your wine! Please! It's a two for me. Yeah. Two. That's, yeah. Although I will say, I will say it does the job, because now I can't feel my tongue. Yeah, that one was weird. Oh, look, I found nail clippers on the floor. <laughs> I've been looking <laughs> This next wine is called Snowflake Encore. Good, that's a right glass. Nine. Wow, I like that one. Yeah, I'd probably say nine, too. Next we have Geometric Trees. Four. I'm gonna give it a five because of the smell. No, if there wasn't a smell, I would give it like a seven. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. This next one is called Dinner with Friends. Six. I think I gotta do six. Yeah. yeah. This next one is called Trey Alberry. Three. Three. My God. I'll probably say a five. If it didn't have a smell, I would say a seven. This one is called Get Jolly by Golly. Oh. Ew. Tastes like a fart in my mouth. Ah, oh, five. Oops. Four. Yeah, that one's not yummy. This next wine is called Treetops. Oh god, negative five. Oh. I don't think the idea is to drink like every oh, single bottle, bottle of the, the same night. Yep. Yeah, it's supposed to be one a day. Oh my god, that's bad. Yep. Very last wine of the day. And it's a cab. Oh my god. It's called Night Lights. Oh. Three, two. Oh, that sucks that it ended on that. Okay, overall though, overall, what would you rate the box itself? I'd give an eight. I thought it had a good variety. I'd probably give it an eight as well. I thought it was fun just to try all the different mm -hmm. types of wine, yeah. even though I didn't really like, you know, yeah, 80% of them. It was nice to just 
sample everything. I thought, was it worth $70? I don't think so personally. <laughs> I didn't pay for it, but even if I did, I would say probably not. <laughs> but was it fun to do? Absolutely. Yes, leave a comment, thumbs up, and subscribe. I'm sweating so bad! <laughs> I have to pee so bad, I can't. I can't stand up though, I'm gonna fall over. <laughs>